Hello and welcome to Driving with Todd. And I'm Todd. We're going to do a request. The request comes in from my reaction to Angelina Jordan doing the song Suspicious Minds. Now the request is not for an Angelina Jordan song. It's for a different group. The YouTuber making the request goes by the name of Kato Tone. And Kato writes, Liliac, and in parentheses, a parentheses, again, question mark, live at Mad Life, song is called Let Me Go, with a great solo by Sam. Sam's the guitarist for Liliac. Filmed live in 2021, but was just released last week. Enjoy. Well, the request came in on December 30th of 2022, last year, so this video must have been released the third week of December. Now, I haven't done a Liliac video in quite a while, so I thought, hey, this would be a great opportunity to see Liliac do one of their songs live. Now, Let Me Go is from Liliac's 2020 album. They released it in 2020 called Queen of Hearts. So here we go. Let's listen to Let Me Go <laughs> by Liliac, live at Mad Life. stop it right here i think we're going to be going into a guitar solo so this would be a perfect breaking point um great heavy song great heavy song i mean uh melody's vocals are top notch like always i mean she just performs like she's been doing this for 50 years I mean, she has just got a, a wild voice for hard rock and she has a great scream and she just drives this group forward then you've got Ethan. Now, he's really becoming an accomplished bass player. If you listen to the bass on, on this, it's really booming. I mean, it's just jamming this song through as well. And he's just hitting a lot of good chords. Just listen to the bass in there. And then, of course, Abigail, right? I mean, she is just a phenomenal drummer. Right in the beginning there, when the song takes off and she's hitting like every skin she can on her drum on her drum kit. Just just excellent stuff. And, and then you've got Justin playing keyboards. He's always a little bit in the background. Now, there, there's been some really good songs where, where Justin's a little bit more up front. But it's always like his keyboards are there, but they're kind of in the background. It seems like the other uh, members, uh, Ethan, uh, Abigail, and Sam, sort of dominate the music. So uh, every once in a while, though, uh, I've, I've, I've done a reaction to a Liliac song where the keyboards really stand out. And, and I really enjoy that because he is a very good keyboard player. And then you got Sam. And I think we're going to hear him go wild pretty soon on his guitar here. Uh, but notice that he was singing harmony 
with uh, uh, melody on, on this particular song, which is kind of cool, too. I like that. So let's get back into the song and see if Sam burns the fretboard up. Here we go. guitar solo i mean sam is, is a very good guitarist and he really you can if you watch his fingers i mean they had they also have close-ups of his fingers on the fretboard he's really methodical on where he places his fingers to get the right notes out of his guitar i always like watching him play because it sounds like he's speed deeming up and down the fretboard but it, it if you watch him it's, it's almost very methodical but what I, what i'm always kind of um, put back by Liliac guitar solos are they're too short. This this is a three and a half minute song. This could easily stretch it out to let's say four and a half minutes, and let's add another minute to Sam's guitar solo. That would have been hot. I think that would have been great. So if I'm disappointed, is that Sam's guitar solo was just too short? But I'm gonna take it back and let's do that guitar solo again. I just love watching him play guitar, especially when they show those close-ups on the fretboard. Okay, here we go. Nice, nice. I really liked, after Sam's guitar solo, they did kind of a, a, a riffing thing between Sam and then Melody's vocals. I really liked that. That was really cool sounding. And then when we got into the end of the song, then Abigail was really going crazy on the drums. I mean, she was just hitting every drum over and over. And, and I thought that was really cool too. Um, good song. Like I said, I wish this would be a, a little bit longer. It could easily be another minute longer and let Sam stretch out on a guitar solo. I'd really like to see that because the guy is a great guitarist. He's done, I mean, for as many years as he's been playing, he's a very established uh, guitar player. But I kind of want to take it back and, and play that part where there, where Sam is riffing his guitar and Melody is doing some screams. I just really thought that was pretty cool how they did that. So I'm going to just go back with that and see if I can find that spot. Okay. I think right about here. Right here. Right here.
I really like that because it was kind of a change up in the song. I mean, it was it's a quite a heavy song. Um, Melody does a lot of of like screams in this song. Really carries this song with a very high vocal, and it's it's got a big heavy bass beat and a lot of heavy drumming. And then after Sam comes out of the guitar solo, it kind of changes up. It slows down just a little bit with him starting to riff on his guitar, and then. Uh, melody doing some great screams and and some vocalization over that riff and they did that like two or three times and 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 really changed up the song and then they went back into the song again like i always like that when they do a change up slows the song down a little bit gets you like oh you know cool yourself down a little bit and then get back in the song and start rocking again good good song really enjoyed this enjoyed this a lot um i hope you enjoyed it if you did, hit that like button. If you have any comments about Liliac doing the song, let me go live at Mad Life. Put in the comments below. That'd be really cool. Now, I'm going to take the link for this video and put it in my notes below so that you can go back and watch this video again because I know you're going to want to. And just click on that link. It takes you right to the video. And sit back, watch it. Hit the like on that video as well. You won't have me interrupting the video. You'll be able to watch the whole thing all the way through. I'm also going to put Liliac's uh, channel, a link to their channel as well. You know, uh, subscribe to their channel if you have not done so. That'd be cool. And then if you haven't, please subscribe to Driving with Todd. That'd be awesome. If you're rock and rolling with Driving with Todd, subscribe to Driving with Todd. I'd really appreciate that. Then go over here, ring that bell, and get updates to my latest videos. This was cool. I'm glad that it was recommended. I did not know this was put up there. Now, there's another um, new video as well. I guess that came out about a week ago by Liliac, and it's the song Queen of Hearts from the album Queen of Hearts. So we'll probably have to go back and, and do a reaction to that one as well. I have not watched it, but it's from the same concert live at Mad Life. So it was well uh well recorded very professionally recorded and the sound is dynamite so we'll have to probably go back and visit that as well so i hope this put a big smile on your face because i put a big smile on my face and peace out baby